Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the big blue house. This could be for my gummy bears, my Geminis, the first half of January 2019. Raw love. Seems so smooth. Everything seems so smooth. All right, what are we looking at? What are we looking at? My little gummy bears. My little gummy bears. That sweet, sweet nectar. Okay, we got the Queen of Swords. I like this Queen of Swords though. Because you're moving forward. Okay, you got a King of Swords right here. Ooh, wee. Ten of Cups. Tower. Tower moment. <clears throat> It's ironic because, wow, 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 someone's watching you, but just wow, um, wow, I have two stories right off the bat though, because I can feel a, a breakup, okay, but hold on, let me just... Um, so this is all about starting a new path with somebody okay it's it's that connection it's the balance um partnership no matter what it is somebody also feels like they're going to be judged right here it's also important to have a plan um but I feel what's going to happen first is is the love the awakening there is karma here even though you guys might not clearly see it but there is it's creative energy it's supporting energy it's helpful energy okay and I, i'm picking that up because a the, the tower it, it's universal when the tower comes in psh, forget it all right something's being taken out um but what this is telling me first before you can go on your path and have all this like wow holy crap this is crazy jummies you have to incorporate love into your life, all right? Um, I think someone's using, like, the spiritual law of attraction here, to be honest with you. I think my gummies are, are calling in somebody, male or female, it doesn't matter, okay? Um, Queen of Swords, yeah, you're not taking no bullshit, but you're also extending your hand, okay? You're also like, okay, if you get a cup for me, you want to start yapping, you want to talk about how happy we can be, where we can go, then let's do this. But in order to do this, there has to be a tower moment. So either you or somebody else, because you can be either one, okay? But you or somebody else is going to cause this by coming in and sharing how they feel, all right? You guys have been waiting for this. Congratulations. You've had a tough year, okay? Um... That was just, like, brutally honest. But for realsies, this is not in somebody's head. This is this is going to happen, okay? Um, I, I, I don't think you're tolerating no bullshit. But I think you're going to have to forgive somebody, all right? Because karma's here, and not only that, you're not tolerating jack shit, okay? Um, <clears throat> tell me about the Queen of Swords. Yeah, so either you walked away or they walked away from you. That is that, that was that breakup I was feeling, okay? I don't know if it's the same person returning, but that's walking to you happy. I'm telling you something right now. This is insane. When the 8 and the 2 come out, it leads to your 10, which is right here. Somebody's going to offer it to you. Or you're going to offer it to somebody. But I feel like this is you guys' energy and someone's going to offer it to you. But it could be the other way around. Tell me about the King of Cups. Alright, so you're not looking... Here's the nice thing. If that's your energy, you're, you're not looking back. You're moving forward. Okay? But it couldn't have been easy. Two of them wanted to come out. So we have Temperance and the Five of Cups. So this person that's coming at you has been through some hardship, okay? They didn't see you over here, or whatever the case may be. I mean, they're just looking now. 
okay? Um, but with temperance being here, I don't know if you're dealing with somebody in the city. This is my city card, sicko, you know? Um, no matter where you live, it's just my city card. But this person right now, this is healing. This is balancing out the two cups. You make this person happy, okay? And can it be petty? Yeah, but I, I don't... I see it working out because calm is here. Okay, so it looks like somebody walked away. Or you walked away. Whether you were together or not, I definitely felt separation. But it looks like it's definitely coming back together. This can be a reconciliation too. Look at the bottom of the deck, the lovers. Wow. So this is what you guys are trying to get to. Because this person's going to come in. They are a little petty. I know I've said that, but I can feel it. Okay, what's this tower going to create? This, t this tower is new, okay? It's a chance to to open up your heart chakra again in love, okay? Um, if this is a breakup, okay? Um, it's this person coming in, sharp, petty, a little sharp, but straight to the point, okay? They could just be a Scorpio, but this is opening your heart chakra. If you guys just broke up, within like recently within the last month or something you've had a breakup this looks person looks like they're coming back tell me about the ace of cups because i don't i don't i don't see new necessarily but it's possible for some for some i, I see it okay happy squirrel so it's it's a mystery all right they're telling me to stop um but you are going to get a message it's going to come in quick okay it's that fast energy so Wow. Let me get your best advice. This definitely looks like the past. I do want to, um, I do want to clarify the Eight of Cups, though. Well, I guess I really don't need to. You guys would know what that's about. Maybe you walked away or they walked away. But it's, it's left up to the universe. And it's very universal. The tower, the universe caused this. Temperance is here to heal this situation ship. Okay? So it, it's, it's guided. Best advice for my gummy bears. It ends up in beauty, guys. Regardless of the shit show, it ends up in beauty, okay? If you choose. For those who went for... Who, those who just went through a breakup, what it's basically saying is... You never know what's coming your way, but take care of you, okay? So we have the dreamer. It's taking a leap of faith following your dreams. Unexpected opportunities. At the bottom of the deck, the need to balance out certain situations and the need to compromise, okay? So just wait and have patience because it's coming in. But don't wait like that. You know you know what court means when I say wait. Make sure you're doing your thing every day. You're happy. You're energizing. You're moving. You're letting the energy flow through your system, you're working on your chakras. You're moving to the music. Okay. But the universe is basically saying, if you can manage to balance this out, here comes your change. Because five is all about change. Okay. It's adventures. It's being flexible, curious, going forward, courageous. This, we knew it called for balance right off the bat anyway. Okay. So as long as you can balance whatever situation you're in, and take a leap of faith, it's going to reach you to the Ten of Cups. And I don't, I actually don't need to clarify the Eight because it's clear as day. You either left somebody to go to your happy and somebody new is coming, or they left you and they're coming back. Whatever this is, it's coming back around the corner. I don't really feel <clears throat> brand new. This is past, it's divinely guided. This might be a little tough, but congratulations, my little gummies, because you deserve this. So I really hope you can mesh the energy and make this work. All right, I'm going to pull you a Ganesha card for the first two weeks of January 2019. They're kind of going to tell you what's either going on with you now. I don't want that one. Protection. What's going on with you now or, or what's going to come? 
that felt better. All right, guidance. And it's it's the six, but I already knew this was guided. Okay, but you you pretty much you got them all, okay? But this is protecting, it's healing, it's being responsible. Sometimes you do have to make sacrifices. This is being fair and just. This is loyalty. Okay, and the divine got you. Now you opened it at divine support, and this is divine support too. Absolutely beautiful. Wow, it's like one of the longest ones. It's too early for this, isn't it? Love you. Guidance is all about learning and communicating with your soul to discover what you want to manifest and what your purpose is. Ganesha is worshipped and adored by the three of them. It's just too early. Brahma, Shivra, and Vishnu. Vishnu? I can't even do that right now. This is the story, okay? It talks about the demolishing of the earth, something that it was evacuated. evacuated. Oh my gosh, it's early. I'm so sorry. I'm going to stop complaining. Guidance is based on communication. The soul can be sent through messages and symbols, synchronicities, hunches, sudden inspiration, dreams, and even a direct channeling. Consciously connect them with your guides and heighten your psychic, psychic abilities. Fine-tune your skills for the present day. Pay attention to all important parts of learning and receiving guidance. As you open up, your soul begins to communicate with the inner purpose for your lifetime adventure. If you learn to hear and recognize certain promptings, your life starts to take a magical twist. Remember that you can ask for Ganesha with support when it comes to raised, you're creating a, a raised awareness. Make a point to look at your spirituality, new perspectives that are unfamiliar to you. Be willing to talk to people with experiences to benefit the difference between theirs and your own. You may have to move out of your comfort zone in order to do this, but it will be a richer, satisfying, more life for you. If you're concerned about the true information about your personal life or psychic intuition, you can prepare by asking from your heart to receive the information for your highest good. Be sure your motivations are pure. Ask to psychic. Ask a psychic to channel the words. You can ask the psychic, your psyche, I, well, it's your psychic, but like your psyche, to channel the words of your own that you want to hear to further spiritual growth. Rely on your intuition and inner knowledge rather than your intelligence or conscious mind. Watch for the synchronicities and opportunities. Trust your instincts and pay attention to the message you turn up with variety of sources. Be attentive to your dreams. You may want to keep your dream journal. Synchronicities are likely now. It is possible that you're having a pleasant supply, a surprise come your way very soon in regards to work and love. This could be a new job opportunity. The gods, Vishnu, Shivra, and Brahma, may represent the different male energy in your life. Engage the energy men in your life or the energy to assist you with the task at hand. So basically... You are coming in as feminine energy, but this can be male too. But right now, my jemmies are in feminine energy. This guy is coming in, okay, with a cup. It can lead to this. Like I said, it's being guided. Open up your spirituality too, okay? It's that, it's that dream. It's the leap of faith. Follow your dreams. Unexpected opportunities are coming. So I don't even think you see this yet. Some of you may, okay? But basically, keep going. Don't let nothing stop you. Let me see what last year's was. Let me see what last year's was. Destiny is knocking. All right. Well, I don't know what happened, but it's knocking again. I have a feeling a lot of my Zodiacs considering they're having me go back 11 months, a lot of my Zodiacs um, repeated a cycle. So please, please, please take care of you. Try not to repeat the same cycle, especially if it's the same person. Make sure it's a different approach. Okay. Take a leap of faith. It's very divinely guided. Beautiful, beautiful messages. Okay. I'm going to pull you a lesson. Congratulations, troops. My little peeps, my little peeps, my little yellow peepities, my little yellow peepities, my little chickadees. A lesson for my gummy bears. What is their lesson here? This is following your soul, your purpose, going towards your happy, finding inner peace, that leap of faith. You might have to, I definitely see you standing your ground too. All right. The purpose of the power and to free and create your own happiness. So in abundance so it talks about you're happy you're happy happy all right abundance all the way around in physical reality you want it create it it's the year 
All right, don't don't be apprehensive. Well, you're gonna be a little apprehensive, but just breathe. Woosa a little bit. Take a step back if need be. And go after you're happy. Okay. So, to me, you're kind of, you're a little weary. But it's all good in the hoodie. Congratulations. Take it slow. Go with the flow. I love you guys. Bye.